In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to enable the FPS count on your Call of Duty Warzone 2. This video is sponsored by cdkeyoffers.com where you can buy legit software, games, and license keys. Just go ahead and search for the games or software you're looking for, hit the buy now button, and simply enter the coupon code DUDE20 to save up up to 20% from your purchase. After paying, you will now immediately receive the key on your account and be able to activate your software or license key. So there are two ways in order for us to enable the FPS counter on Warzone 2. The first one is the in-game settings and the second one is using the Steam client. So the most common one is to enable it using the Warzone 2's in-game settings. So go to the settings option on your Warzone and then click on the interface option right here. You're going to be shown with a bunch of settings right here. Go ahead and scroll down to the bottom until you see the telemetry settings right here. It might be set to essentials right here. Go ahead and click on the show more button and you'll be able to see here the FPS counter. Make sure to turn this one on. By default, it might be turned off and you could also opt to turn on the other options right here such as the server latency, packet loss, and the graphics card or GPU temperature monitoring overlay. Once done, it should already show you immediately the FPS counter on the top left portion of your screen and that's how easy it is to enable it using your in-game settings. However, if you are using Steam, you could also enable it using the Steam FPS counter. Go ahead and open up your Steam client and then go to the Steam option right here and click on the settings. It should show you the settings window right here. Go ahead and go to the in-game settings and you should be able to see here an in-game FPS counter option. Go ahead and click on this drop down button right here and it should show you some options right here. Go ahead and select whichever you'd prefer the FPS counter be shown on your screen and you'll be shown with a bunch of options right here. Go ahead and just select which best fits your preference. You could also click the high contrast color right here and once done just go ahead and simply hit the OK button and then restart your Warzone game. And as you can see we already get the FPS counter showed on the top left portion of our screen.